What's up guys, this is iTweaks here, and today I'm going to be showing you Multi-Icon Mover Plus. Now this is a staple in all of my jailbroken devices just because it's very, very convenient to have and makes everything extremely easy when you're trying to move icons around. So there's actually been some upgrades to Multi-Icon Mover, and if you aren't familiar with Multi-Icon Mover, what it does is allow you to get your device or your icons into wiggle mode, and then you can tap on icons just like that. So this is going to allow me to move as many icons as I tap to whatever page that I want. So let's just say that I wanted to create a new page. So we're just gonna swipe over here, and this is the new page. Once I hit the home button, all five of those icons are gonna go directly to that page. But of course, it doesn't have to be a new page. You can add two more icons right here if you wanted to do that, as you can see right there. All you have to do is just tap on those, make sure the check mark is on the icon, and then swipe to the page that you want, and then push the home button that's gonna put those in there. So there's also some other things that we need to check out right here. So if we go into our settings and we tap on Multi-Icon Mover Plus, we have some options right here. So right up here at the top, we have Appearance. So we can have this set to check marks, or we can actually change this to numbers. So this is going to basically allow you to see how the icons are gonna be arranged on that next page that you put all the icons on. So if that doesn't really make sense, if we go over here and let's just say we're going to tap on the clock, you can see it has a one right there. Tap on settings, it has a two. And then three, four, five, and you can see that's how it's all set up. So if you're moving icons from a bunch of different places, then it's going to tell you how those icons are gonna be arranged on that next page. So if we swipe over here to our last page that we just added, you'll see if we hit the home button, they're gonna go directly in that particular order. So let's jump back here into the settings and we're gonna go back. You'll also notice that you can move folders. So if you toggle this on, this is going to allow you to move folders as well. Now if you wanna open up the folder to move icons within the folder, then you'll just have to double tap on the folder in order to open it. Or you can just do a single tap again once you have that uh, tick mark or the number on that folder. So if we go back here, let's try to find a folder. Let's swipe over here. So now if we get our device into wiggle mode and we tap on that, you can see that it's going to move that folder. We can very easily just move the folder right over here. Now if we wanted to open up the folder to move icons within the folder, then we can just double tap and it's gonna open up the folder. So very simple, very self-explanatory right there. So if we tap on settings again, we can come down here to icons. You can actually move icons on the same page now. So if we just toggle that on, it'll allow us to do that. You can also overflow to the next page. So if you select too many icons to fit on a single page, then it's going to overflow into the next page and put those icons on the next page. Also right down here, you can change this from the bottom of the page to the top of the page. So where do you want your new icons to be set? Either the top of the page or the bottom. So this has always been set to the bottom of the page. So I'll show you what the top of the page does. And we'll also do a same page move right here. So if we go back here and let's just say that we wanted to move our folders uh, as well as the camera app to the top of the page. So we'll just put this in wiggle mode, tap on that, tap on that. And then when we hit the home button, they're gonna go to the top of the page, just like that. So that's the same page move as well as moving icons to the top of the page. So if you guys weren't familiar with multi-icon mover before this video, hopefully you guys have a pretty good idea of how this works and why it is so convenient to have on your device. So let me know what you guys think about Multi-Icon Mover Plus in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. All right, guys, until next time, peace.